Hello and welcome to the final week of the season. Three under chases for you today. We start off with the Apple Tree Motor House under chase at Stratford, two miles two and a half. Holland Mark Cooper, Lord North Pontypool Racing, Impanina Hat, Alex Cherry, and Link Sydney Mark Cooper. Mark Cooper has two horses in his race. Joint top with ten winners with Martin leading on top. Martin doesn't have a run in this race. So a chance for Mark Cooper to take the lead. And the only one that could play in this is Alex Cherry, who has one in this. He wins all three. He'll join Martin and Mark Cooper on a ten apiece. So, all to play for. Holland is the first one to show. Three to four from Impanina play up Plod in second. And then comes Link Sydney, Lord North on the outside, dropping into an to chase. Jump in the next fence. I'll oh, jump it safely. Holland leads by four to five from Lynx. Sydney in second. Lord North back in third. And in between the plod in fourth. Lord North, because wasn't bred for this game. I'm jumping. He has won a cup. Although he's won on the hurdles in the league this season. But he's dropped into this because. He's not a very good. Oh, we lost one there, and Alex Cherry has lost in between the plod, and that means Mark Cooper has two goals again to the top of this Anthers Table League Championship. Martin has led all the way up to now, but I feel that Martin's run out of ammunition for the Anthers. He had a good week this week, though, the final week of the season. I hope you get well soon, Martin. I hope that cough disappears soon for you, mate. I'll see you next season. I suppose we'll have a chat in between then together, mate. Holland by four to five from Link Sydney in second. Lord North a length away in third. Marlon and Phil on left with a jump that. So Lord North is Martin is hoping win this, he's 120 rated Dirdler, Lord North, so he's got ability, and this is a really low grade, and his chase, oh, the leader took a chance with that one, that was Holland, and a couple of clear, Lord North, he jumped the ditch, oh, no, jumped it safely, good camera work there, and it's Holland, by a couple of instances, Link Sydney in second and Lord North just a neck away in third. They've only got six and a half left to run, and Holland is still about four to five to stable mate Link Sydney, and on the outside, Lord North head towards the next five and a half left to run. And so you go towards the next fence. Holland jumps it well. Ooh, Lord North took a chance, made a mistake. Has lost the length and a half on the second off there. Dink Sydney was trying to close on his front one in stable mate. Holland. There's about two and a half clear now of Dink Sydney jumped the ditch. A similar distance to Lord North. And can Lord North get his speed on her of his flat ability? Holland. Oh, they've gone away the front two, Holland and Sydney, they've drawn away from Lord North, who now looks to spent force in second. They're swinging on on, two left to run, right, and Link Sydney's got to the front now. Uh, Mark Cooper could go to the top of the table here. Yeah. Holland back in second. Lord North, really truck is sitting still on that one in third, although he's making it on, on to the second now. they got full on left to run and out in front Link Sydney is clear Lord North probably just going second now past the beaten Holland who set this race up for his stable mate I believe and Link Sydney Matt Cooper will the top of the Dunters chase wins by five to six Lord North in second Holland back in third so we have a new leader up top of the Dunters table Matt Cooper and Link Sydney and we'll go on to the next race and the final hunters at Stratford in a minute. I'll see you soon.